I'm going to kind of start off with a file that has some problems. Uh, the last the last session we did in part one, we kind of baked in some issues that you might run into. And I did the same here. You, your mileage will vary. In other words, you know, you may not have some of these problems I've kind of added to this. But let's just go in and start with creating a brand new, whoops, brand new WMS. So we'll come in under file and new. That's what has to be done. It's not a, an image that you would have local on your system. You would have to hit a server first to create that new map. Once you do, it creates a, a version of it, if you will, for uh, that is local. Um, and what we're going to do is start off by picking a server. Again, you look at a list of servers that are here. You can look from the drop down that's here. The list of servers, there's no guarantee that some of these are going to be there tomorrow. If they're your server and you set it up, you most definitely can. You can go to that servers dialog you just saw and add uh, one that you know will be there. But for example, in, in our case, I'm just going to attach one, right? So I might come in and say, okay, uh, let's go attach, uh, I don't know, we'll come in here and just go to, uh, there's one that's a base map if I can see it. There it is right here and we might say okay we're going to pick uh, the topo usgs topo so we'll select that this is uh you know the us geological survey i know this will be here tomorrow if i select it so i'll pick that and use it as my example normally with this server it's pretty instantaneous but uh, for whatever reason it took a little bit this morning so we have a layer that sits in here and the way these are put together is we have uh, these maps that we create that are WMS. They have all different layers, different types of data. This one only has one simply called layers. Uh, you can probably guess what this one will be. This is a topo map. So I'm gonna select it. Um, obviously you'll see some in a little while that have multiple options in here. I'm gonna hit add to map. Now that adds that layer right down into here. All right. I'm going to just click save and attach. That's all I'm going to do. But I will tell you, there is a preview tab that's here. Try to use this, guys, because immediately when I go to preview, and if I was working in this area that is my vector data, I know I probably don't need the whole world as an image attached. Um, certainly, I would know that there's going to be a problem just by going to preview. So I will tell you, use the preview. But well, let's say I didn't. I just come in. I'm using this for the first time. I've attached it. Looks good to me. I'm going to hit save. If you found this video helpful, please give it a like. If you want to see more such series, consider subscribing to our channel. Thank you, and see you next time.